Hi, my name's Amy Gibson. These are the Jesus interviews. I'm sharing with you what I believe are Jesus Christ's responses to my prayers. As he speaks to me, I just write down his words, then I share them with you for your own opinions and decisions. Conversation, contemplation, this is not advice. We've been talking a lot about world peace. And Jesus shared that when the planet Earth was created, world peace was always the intention. And so I asked Jesus, what's the strategy? How can we make world peace reality? This is what Jesus Christ said. And how to achieve world peace only when we have world prosperity. And world prosperity is not world poverty, and it isn't. And we pause. And world prosperity was the condition of the planet Earth on the first day of its completion. Perfect, plentiful, beautiful, natural, and abundant. And on the first day, the world was paradise, and it was. And the world was peaceful from the first day of its completion. And yet, as the population of human beings expanded and conquered and processed and took control of the planet Earth, the world became polluted and dangerous and impoverished. In these modern times, world peace is a decision and a choice for each and every living creature of the planet Earth. This is where we begin to look within, to seek God, to ask God to live within each and every heart and soul of living creatures of the planet Earth. And the wisdom will come. And wisdom comes to those who choose peace, peace of mind first. Wisdom is drawn to peace and wisdom is nurtured in a peaceful mind. Do you see how a turbulent mind cannot nurture wisdom? Just as a storm will take down a beautiful tree, a troubled mind, confused, angry, frustrated, argumentative, has no room for wisdom. And then Jesus said, let your mind find quiet. Find peace and wisdom, wisdom will flow to you. And Jesus is right beside you. And if you decide to ask, Jesus will help you and he will. And this is the truth. And so here is your free experiment, which costs no money. If you ask Jesus to guide you, a way will be made for you. And this is the first step toward world peace. World peace begins within, within each and every heart and soul and mind of every living creature on the planet Earth. And how to have an environment to facilitate a peaceful mind. And leaders, do your people have a place for peace? And homeowners, have you created a peaceful area to breathe and think and imagine and visualize and pray. And your home is where you live. And have you created a space for you to receive wisdom? And if you cannot, you have the opportunity to ascend your environment circumstance by overcoming from within. And this is a heightened state of consciousness. The renovation of rundown buildings in neighborhoods and natural spaces into beautiful living places of peace and tranquility will increase the availability and opportunity to practice peace from within. 
And so, as people choose peace as a way of life, life on earth becomes peace, world peace. And peace is the only way to happiness. And that's what everyone really wants. From Jesus Christ to you, world peace. And I appreciate your time.